hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i am just currently getting ready as you can tell i look horrendous it is currently half past nine in the morning and i just thought i'd vlog today just out of just fun i don't know random i may turn it into like a weekly vlog i don't know yet but yes i'm currently getting ready because later on i'm meeting my best friend holly in town and we're gonna watch the new jennifer lawrence film which i am so excited about i i literally love jennifer lawrence so i'm gonna take you guys along with that oh please ignore that stain on the top just just ignore it i had food <laughs> but yeah it's just gonna be one of them vlogs which is gonna be a bit random maybe just a bit all over the place but that's what i love about filming and just making content because you never know what you're gonna get up to i'm just gonna get ready quickly and then show you guys my outfit oh my god when i put my hair up because i used to have a fringe this is what happens we don't talk about that it's just a bit annoying <laughs> i've already done concealer i only wear concealer i don't wear um foundation or anything like that so i'm just gonna go ahead in with my powder right now and as we are in town, I actually need to get um, grab a new eyebrow pencil because I'm currently, <laughs> I've run out and I'm using this Essence brow powder. I don't necessarily love brow powder, but it was it's the only thing that I've got in here. And please ignore my, what are these called? Please ignore that dinging sound. It's a bit windy outside. I have my window open and it is setting off my, I've literally forgot what, what it's called, but that's okay. So I'm going to go ahead and do brows real quick and then we'll move on to the next step. So what I'm actually using here is the Essence Fix It Like a Boss Brow Fixing Gel. This thing is so good. Essence makeup is so affordable and in the UK you can get it from like Wilco's. That's where I get it from. There's a Wilco's in my town so I'm going to go and pop in there as well. See what's new in Wilco's. Love a good Wilco shop. And we're going to just grab an eyebrow pencil and maybe some other bits and bobs that we might find on the way. So please let me know if you would want me to like do what's new in like different types of shops. Because I absolutely love watching them videos like what's new in B&M, what's new in Home Bargains, what's new in The Range. The Range at Halloween and Christmas time is my favourite time. I absolutely love autumn and Halloween. I can't wait for them vlogs. Just can't wait. Go pumpkin patch picking. <laughs> oh my god. And the outfits as well. Like when we go like thrifting again. When I take you on another thrift with me. Like a mini black skirt with tights and like darks. And then like a woolly, woolly jumper. I can't wait. <laughs> but yeah just. I'm going to make a whole video of what to expect on this channel. And like a get to know me. Because I feel like I haven't done that yet. I feel like I should. You, you guys need to get to know me um but yeah i i can't wait for all that stuff so let's go on with my brows <laughs> i am not the best at brows all i do is literally just line them up a little bit like and then just shade them in i'm not a very good person with eyebrows just gonna be honest i do a little bit of contour um i don't do go crazy in the contour I make myself look a little bit more less pale let's put it that way i am using this really old actually i need a new bronzer it's just a Revolution Pro sculpting sculpting. You know what I mean? Bronzer. Um, I mean, I'm gonna show you it, but it's very, very dirty, full of makeup and everything else. Um, but there's the inside. Hi. <laughs> also, I want to say a big thank you to the support on my last video, like my first video, which was the thrift with me. I mean. I've only just started this channel so I'm not expecting to get thousands and millions of views but the video was quite successful and I've had people messaging me saying that they really enjoyed it so it makes me feel so happy because honestly that video I woke up not expecting to film a YouTube video and that's crazy to me that I would have not have uploaded if I didn't you know you know what I mean <laughs> I just yeah just thank you so much just remember to subscribe it helps out a lot and like the videos if you want to see more content and yeah i really enjoy making youtube videos so for nose contour which i literally just do like two lines blend it into like my eyelid and eyebrow i am not very good at nose contour but hey ho we try <laughs> 
So I use the uh, Jeffree Star. Can you see that by Morphe? Next, we move on to blush, which I do mix my blushes up a lot. Um, so I do have the Backstage Dior one. Now this is such a pretty shade. It's like, it's very light pink. So I normally put it on top of um, something a little bit more darker. So I'm gonna be using this Kylie Jenner blush. Um, the shade is in Baddy on the Block. And then I'm just gonna show you the shade real quick. So there it is. The mirror is very dirty, but such a pretty color. God, I can't get over the packaging. It's so cute. So I'm gonna do blush and I'm gonna show you the whole finished product because this video is already like nearly 12 minutes long and we haven't even gone outside yet. So <laughs> let's speed things up. Here's my outfit. I decided to just switch and go with the Brandy Melville long sleeve and then I've just got these that I actually got from Vintage Fair. They're like early 2000s because they're like low rise. But yeah, and then I've done my hair just in a half up half down situation and then I just have my Vivian Westwood necklace on. Oh and my promise ring from Pandora. <laughs> I think I'm ready. This is going to brush my teeth and then we'll be ready to go. Use the Kylie Cosmetics highlighter as well. And then I have the Essence mascara. But yeah, I'm sorted. I'm going to go pick our bag now. What would fit this outfit? Oh, I sprayed some perfume and it's like got on my top. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll see you guys whenever. I think I'm going to go with this Billy bag. I got it from a car boot sale. About a year ago now I'm gonna say and oh my gosh I love Billy bags it's like the perfect early 2000 vibes but yeah I'm gonna use this swan Okay, so I'm in Wilco's now and we're gonna look at the skincare and obviously Essence makeup for my eyebrow pencil. But Wilco's at the minute has a 50% off, so we're gonna check out the deals. So Clearasil is a really good brand. I really like the oh they're out of stock, but the pads, see there's like a big sale on. So these would have been £3.50, but they don't have any left, obviously. Um this is really good. I've never tried it before, but clearer cells tend to like clear up my acne really well. Have you guys ever tried this sunny shaving gel? It's £2.70 from £4. And I do need a new shaving gel, so I might pick this up. So I've seen these everywhere and people are like hyping them up. It's apparently like body cream. I don't know. There's different types and they're only five pounds. I've tried the um, hair ones, you know, like the hair mask ones, but I've never tried the body cream. I don't think I'm going to get it though because I have a lot of moisturizers and body creams. So this is the mascara that I use, it's the Lash Princess one. So I've used the green one and now I'm onto the purple and honestly it's so good. This one gives you like a sculpted volume and there's like different ones like curling volume, full lash, lash effect and they're only £3.25, so good. I think I do actually need a new loofah, should I get a white or a pink one? I think I might get a pink one. Get one from the back because, you know, <laughs> I just feel like, I feel like people would understand. We're only 50p, so let's put that in. So these are so good. These Dove 
um, different types of like body washes. So they have hydrating care with aloe and birch water or anti-stress. I love these so much. And also, these are like my new favorite things. So this scent here is like amazing. Highly recommend. So I'm actually grab one for my shower. Which one should I get guys? So I've had that, that one up there before, but there's so many different types of scents and I just don't know. So this one, okay. This one's strawberry and raspberry. I think I might go for this one. I think these ones are really fun they're only two for one pound 80 and i have i've had this one before but i've never had these two i might try them again next time though because i've already just put one in my basket i don't really need shampoo but i am currently using this one the pink bottle and it's actually worked for my hair really well it makes it like naturally curly um yeah there's so many different types to choose from but yeah i love the l'oreal paris shampoo and conditioners I just saw the cutest dog and did you know dogs are actually allowed in Wilco's? Oh my gosh, so the scrub daddies are on offer at £1.50 but the pink one is still £2.50 I might grab one because ours went a bit like horrible <laughs> not long ago and we've been looking to get another one because they're so good, they last forever so I might pick up the original one because they both work the same really How early 2000s is this? Oh my god. <laughs> is this like cute or is it old grandma style? <laughs> I just love the little cute flowers and it's only 275. Also, I am in scents right now, the charity shop. Um, I went in here the other day so nothing much has changed but I thought I'd nip in and have a look. I'm so sad, this is a fitted cot sheet and I have a double bed. <laughs> I literally would have grabbed it if it was for a double. Oh my god, so cute. So I just tried this on and I know some of you might think it's ugly or grandma style. But I thought for autumn time, you know, with like some, like a mini skirt. Um, sadly, it's just a little bit tight for my liking. I like jumpers and like sweaters to be quite oversized. And I thought when I held it up to me, I mean, the length is a good, but it's just the sleeves. Like, I'd prefer them to be a little bit more, you know, a bit more oversized, but sadly, not today. So I'm now back at home. Oh my gosh, that movie was a 9 out of 10. I absolutely loved it. Just so good. And I feel like from the ending, I'm not going to spoil, but I feel like there's going to be a second movie based on the ending. But I highly recommend you go watch it. It was so good. But I'm home now. And I think I'm just going to wrap up the vlog here. Um, but yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this randomness. I know I said I was might do a weekly vlog, but I might do that another time. Stay tuned. <laughs> so I just thought I'd start off with maybe a daily vlog, you know. We'll continue the vlogs and other types of videos. Just make sure you hit that subscribe button and like this video for more content. See you guys next time. Bye!